Hey Beaver Buddies, this is your friend Sarman here back with another episode of Timberborn. It's been a minute since we've uh, had one, so I thought it was high time we got another one out. I hope you're having a fantastic and amazing day today. And uh, we're going to be just developing the town on this one a little bit more. That's kind of how uh, Beaverville works, <laughs> Timberborn works. It's not so much uh, technology oriented as uh, our settlement survival is. So we're just going to kind of just let it go. I, I did a little bit of in-between episode playing as you can see we have this part of the wall done already pretty good coming along so my goal for this episode is to at least get all of this inside wall done and then probably try and figure out what we're gonna do over on this end I I'm thinking I might just like cap this off or something at the beginning and just try and see how far we can push the green I want the green to be all over the whole thing and then we can figure out how do we want to proceed as far as growth there i think there was a uh, metal around i think it was over here yep so here's the metal so in my opinion i think we need to get this metal i don't think there's anything else close by there's one right there what's that nothing that matters okay so yeah i think that's what we got to do we got to work toward this metal or work toward this metal and then we can start advancing a little bit more so i think it might be cool so since there's kind of, not really, but a kind of staircase here, so we have this one platform, and then this platform, and then here. I'm thinking we do like a bridge of some kind, right in this area, and come down and do like a stairs along the cliffside. And then kind of come over here, and then kind of stairs down into this area here. And we could even dump some water down from up here to fill in some of these red, or red spots, these dead spots. And uh, that, that could be good. Oh, it looks like we have ourselves a lack of materials issue. So we could see, where is that? What is this? Oh, that's our grill. Okay, I'm able to get potatoes, it looks like. Oh, so maybe we need to store up some potatoes. It's got to be it. So we'll just let it go for now. Uh, we That was in our last episode. We got ourselves some grilled potatoes and we got some growing right here. There's not a ton. So I think the grill kind of cooked up what we had and then it ran out. That's what my guess would be. Let's see, we got any potatoes over here? Yeah, nothing in storage. So this isn't quite good enough. We're going to have to put in another farm eventually here. So if we could get this water situation back here figured out, that could be really good. And this side too, because I want trees up here. So it's something we got we to gotta work on here. And it looks like this is done. I don't know if they can reach that yet again. We got six logs in there already. Perfect. Okay. So now let's go ahead and we will continue to stretch out this way. Uh, where, where am I doing here? Landscaping? Yeah. And then we're going to go levee. And then we're going to go, we'll do one of these and just kind of follow the same pattern that we have been doing going around. And then we get stuck right there because these bushes are in the way here. Uh, I have I had the, I have had these marked for removal for a long time with this guy. And then mark resources for demolition and they just don't go away so i'm not sure if i'm missing something or maybe they're out of range ah they're out of range so that's the deal i was wondering like what the heck's going on why are these still here so i think we're gonna have to snake a road down like so and then as it progresses the the, the pathway will have to progress this way we'll be able to reach more and more of these things but yeah, but there's guys picking berries over there right now. I think it's, I think it might be different though. I don't know. I'm not sure. If, if you know what's going on, let me know if I'm right or not with the path thing. I think that's what it is because it needs workers to move the things to delete the stuff. And we have to build them there anyway, so we're gonna need it. But I was kind of hoping that this would fill in and be a pathway for us because we have stairs on this end, but eh, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Anyways, it looks like this, wow, that, that went up really quickly so we must be doing really good with our balance of logs as i say that i see we have practically zero logs i did turn off our production of planks don't need planks right now and i'm just toggling on when we need planks it, it's just a little balancing thing that i learned uh, the hard way that if you just have this running all the time you really don't have any logs so it's it's good to keep that in mind so I, we have what we got over here we got some pines we got ourselves some maple and, and more pines right here yep yeah. Okay, so this guy's, these guys look like they're good to go to get harvested, so that's that's great. And it looks like they can be, and we are in the middle of a drought, but it doesn't matter because we have that all worked out already. Hmm. 
Yeah, this end is, is going to be something. We're going to have to delete some of these ro uh, this road back here. And kind of snake up this way. Oh, okay, look at that. Now this whole, all these boobs are gone. That's perfect. That's what I needed. Can we... Yeah, delete that one. I must have missed that guy. So we'll go here, demolish. And we'll go delete resources. Boop. Okay. We'll get rid of that guy. And then we can continue our pathway. That was really quick. Not bad, not bad. Like so... Then we can get rid of this stuff, and then we can fill this in. And, uh, oh, while I'm looking at it, I want to do this too before I forget. So we are prepared. And, ooh, it would be really good if I could make a, make make this connected. And you know how I can do that? I can go into pathway, and then we can do platform. And we can do one, two, three, four, five, six. Kind of feels like a waste because uh, we will have access on this end and access here for whatever we have to do. But meh, we'll put it in there. This is going to require some planks, so we're going to need a good amount of planks, which we won't have all the planks for. Yeah, we're out of them now, so that's okay. We will uh, we'll get some more. We'll cook it. We'll get some more on the way. I'm just more worried about the levees for now. This is really extra, an extra thing. Okay, yeah, this is nearly completed. That's got to be what was wrong with it was the the uh, the roads there, no access, so we can get the rest of this stuff put in like so, and uh, we got to get that guy though. Can you guys reach this without a path? Let's see. We'll do one of those, and we'll do like that because I want to be able to reach this because we're still. Uh, what? Oh, there we go. We're still going along this way, so I can't. I don't want to block this. I want to see if we can get rid of this before we do anything else. See so we go here. Okay, yeah, it's in with it's in with range. We'll still have to do something to get these other uh, bushes taken care of. It looks like. So let's go ahead and we can say demolish, and we'll do the demolish resources again, and we'll just go ahead and we'll sneak in this way like that, and we'll build a path. And then we'll be able to access those guys. We probably don't have to go this whole way. Honestly, it, it probably just has to be a little bit. Yeah, it's, yeah. So if we could, I do want to save some of these resources, but eh, it'll work. It'll be fine. We'll do this. Maybe we can build something in this little area. Uh, we could clear it. We could clear most of this out and just have like a blueberry patch in here and do like the rest and do farms in the rest of the space. That might be a good idea because we're going to need farms. Um, and uh, this space is kind of to be determined what we're going to do with it at this point so we could even put in another tree farm oh we could do trees right in here because this forester can reach them but then do our lumberjacks reach yeah so we could definitely put in some more trees over here i think we're gonna do that i don't feel like that could hurt too bad so i'm gonna go with maple because these are good but they take a long time to grow but we're gonna do a handful of them like so and then i'm gonna do some pines just because they are a little bit quicker and I want to double check to see what that range of that forester was. Okay, good. We can go one more right there like that. Okay. I don't I don't love this. <laughs> we'll definitely probably move this stuff around. Uh, like, like once we can go down here, we could do this whole deal uh, for us. Or we could, you know, find like these platforms and, and dedicate these platforms to certain things. Ooh, I didn't realize this was all like that. That's awesome. Lots of trees over there. Pretty good. Let's just take a quick peek at how we're doing with resources. We haven't even looked at that yet. We went like crazy on science points we might even have too many beavers working on that we could shift some around but for now i think we'll just leave it because what we have unemployed nobody's unemployed everybody's busy so it's, it's it's good we're doing great i got four people building and moving stuff around i think that's good I'm trying to put this wall up as quickly as possible and it looks like we are ready for the next step in that so let's go ahead and we'll put our levy in one of these one of those one of these oh oh that was kind of weird. Oh, I stacked it. So I'm going to cancel this one. And then it looks like I have to delete some more resources. This blueberry patch is kind of a pain in the butt, wasn't it? Let's go like that and do levy. Boop, boop. Like so. And that I know that would work like this because you can do an angle. Whoops, did it again. Same spot. <laughs> you can do it at an angle like the water isn't going to go out this way. But I want to be able to walk across this whole deal. So we're going to have to put a levy in, so we have to wait a little bit until we can get rid of that uh, other piece that is in the way there, that little blueberry bush. Okay, there. We'll just hold off for just a second. And then we can, maybe we can even work on 
expanding our little village over here, we can get some more beavers going. Because we're doing okay with food right now. And if we got rid of some of this stuff and turned it into another farm, that could be really, really good as well. You know, maybe that's what I want to do. We could always add in blueberries again. I think what I'm going to do is we are going to delete all of these resources. And maybe we'll leave... Maybe we'll leave a little bit down here for little blueberry bushes for, you know, whoever wants blueberries. But we don't even have anybody gathering them, so we're really... There's really no point in even having them if we're not going to have a gatherer on it. Uh, I think... I think I heard somewhere that if you have carrots, which is a preferred food over blueberries, they're not even going to eat the blueberries. So there's no point in gathering them. And I haven't been gathering them for a while, and we're still at 146, so they aren't depleting them at all. So that, that, that seems like it's the case. Uh, okay, so over on this end, we got to get rid of some of these guys as well. Uh, this guy, one of these, one of those. Okay, like so. And everything should be in range now because we have pushed out these pathways to be here. They weren't going to be temporary, but maybe we'll do another farm on this side and then we can uh, use the path that we put in. I'm, you know what? I'm going to get rid of these. <laughs> I wanted to keep them. It's going back and forth. We'll, we'll just let's get rid of them. We can always add in more blueberries later. Plant trees and bushes right here. You can add more blueberries, so not that big a deal. And we're at 146, so they're not even eating them. They, they are eating the carrots. You can see that number is fluctuating quite a bit. So yeah, let's get, we'll get more potatoes, we'll get more carrots, and we could even consider getting some more wheat and working on some bread stuff, which I haven't done yet. Uh, but I feel like that's kind of unnecessary at this point. I'm not really sure what the progression path should be in this game. This is, we're kind of doing this together for the first time. The, uh, the stream that I did on this game, we got to the point where I lifted up the water level one, and then uh, it, was, it was a long stream, so I decided to call it there. Long stream for me is like two and a half, three hours. <laughs> but we had uh, APH in there the whole time and he was guiding us so we didn't screw it up and ruin our whole town and learned the beaver ways. So that was very nice of him to do that for us. So let's just take a peek at what we could learn with all of our tech points we have. Almost 2,000 tech points is pretty insane. So distribution posts and drop off point. Okay, that's interesting. Distributes goods to other districts. Ooh, that's really good. That's really good. And uh, this guy is where they're just going to receive, so that's that's out and that's in. Housing? Ooh, a triple lodge. That could be cool. Unique to this faction. 250? Yeah, let's do that. And then I'm going to grab these as well. I mean, we got tons of points here. Uh, maybe we don't want to burn up all the points we have in case we need something on the fly. Like, uh, oh, these suspension bridges look... They sound really cool. I'm really curious about it. So this is a... I'm wondering what they mean by... Is that, is that the width? Like the one by one is that? No. Let's see. Let's see. Grab a suspension bridge. What can we do with this? Oh. Okay, so it goes into the void and goes in betwixt platforms. So you would have to like have an elevated platform up here and then do like these platforms and then have a bridge across if you wanted to do that. But then you'd have to have stairs as well. So um, <laughs> might be tricksy to have the same levels of everything. Oh, I had an idea. That would be insane. <laughs> I was thinking, what if we took this water we have, we have it, bring it over here, and we build up from this platform like a like a canal, and fill it up, and bring water like all the way over here, and fill this whole deal up with water. Like it would be contained, but fill this whole thing up with water. For what purpose? I don't know. Just to do it, I guess. <laughs> but maybe later. Well, I want to work on going this way first before we do any of that kind of craziness. So it looks like the drought is over. So everything's green and happy again for the most part. And uh, let's see. Uh, well, it's not quite completed. It's got a couple of little studs left. And, and these, of course, aren't done because we need the planks. So over on this end, let's work on this a little bit more. And uh, we need to have this guy. One of these. One of those. And one of these. And one of those. OK, so we got that. And we have our way up is going to be here. So we want to seal this off somehow, right? So let's go ahead and we'll demolish buildings. And that's going to be this, like so. And then we're going to need to have ourselves landscaping. And we're going to put this in like this for now. Um, I'm just wondering what I want to do to... Well, I don't know if I want these in yet. How am I going to level this? So I have to... To level this... To raise it up, I mean, not level it. 
So we have dams in here right now, right? That's what these are. So you have to knock out one of the dams, replace it with a levee, and then do the same over on this side. So we're going to have to have access, which we can. We will have access because we have the stairs here. So I think we'll be good. Might take a little bit of tinkering around with. We'll get it worked out. And then we want the water to go out this way eventually. I think. I think. But we'll just hold off for now for that. We, I think we might have to go one more up if we want to spill water out this way. Or there are water pumps and then there are, uh, what is it called? Like a, a water dump. Yeah. So you can pump up the water and then dump it somewhere. So you could we could make like a pond down here and dump the water into the pond from this river, which could be neat to do. Or we could build an artificial one and do that up here too. Another option. Or <laughs> there's an irrigation tower uh, that you could fill up apparently. I haven't done it yet. I've never seen these. I don't know how they work. We could that could be something we could grab 200 points what do we got now uh, just over a thousand uh and it doesn't take any gears so let's let's grab this i'm very curious to be to see what this thing does it looks like that's the road okay i want the road to be on this guy right here so we'll do that and i'm wondering if if the beavers themselves dump the water or if something else uh, or it fills up the irrigation tower, I mean, or if there's like pumps or something else that we need to get. So it looks like we'll miss a little bit of the inside here that needs to be uh, uh, watered, I guess, fertilized. That's okay. This isn't really going to be, isn't really going to matter if that's not green other than probably bothering me because it's different from everything else. But uh, that's, that's something for later to worry about. So we are definitely going to need some planks. That's going to be 40 planks. And then we need, I think these are four piece. Yeah. So we're short some planks for sure. Just kind of need to let her let her grow and get some more logs happening. And we got our extra trees in here and we could do uh, our farm over here. So let's go ahead. We'll get our farmhouse. And ooh, so this reaches much further than I was thinking. OK, I want this whole deal. So we're going to put in another farmhouse. And I don't think that these two guys could run this whole deal by themselves. So I think we need to have another farmhouse anyways. So let, look, look at that. It'll sneak in it just perfectly. That's how I wanted it. We'll get that started. Put a path down like so. And, you know, we're probably going to need... Do we need any gatherers or anything like that over here? No, that's just our lumberjack leg. Okay, I think that'll be good. And once this gets built and we get people in it, or beavers in it working, then we can plant a new farm and we'll be good to go. Our beavers are just working away over here on the wall. They're, they're doing great. It looks like there's a couple of pines that are matured and ready to be cut. So they're doing that right now for us. And we're just kind of waiting for this to get built up. And uh, then we're good to go. And I think that's going to wrap up this episode. Thanks for coming and hanging out with me. I hope you enjoyed uh, Tumorborn. And I hope to see you on the next episode. Have a fantastic and amazing rest of your evening, day, or night.